What's up YouTube? It's me, Paulie C. Uh, today we're outside. Um, it's a relatively nice day for February. It's about uh, 32 Fahrenheit, zero Celsius. Um, I'm going to do something that I really like doing. Um, it's reviews on uh, camping equipment. Uh, today we're going to do a little unboxing, so let's go. Okay, and there you have it. It's the uh, it's the Coleman uh, Classic backpack uh, stove. And let's open this thing up. For me, this is the first time I've ever had a small stove like this. Like I have the Coleman stoves that you take camping and such. Um, I really I like seeing these videos online, so I want to check it out for myself. Uh, these boxes. Okay, I don't really care about the box. There we go, we got the instructions. Um, it should be pretty straightforward to use. I believe you pull these out. Uh, these type of stoves don't use the um, normal one pound uh, propane tanks. They actually use um, these isobutane uh, canisters, which, uh, let's see, they're 230 grams or 8.11 ounces. So, let's off here. These are pretty easy to install. I'll get this thing out of the way. Let's get this garbage out of here, too. Yeah, these things are uh, pretty uh, relatively easy to light. All you got to do is um, give it a little bit of gas, get lighter, and just lit. Let's blow this up. There's the maximum there. So what we're going to do is a little test, a little um, boiling water test in the saucepan. I'm going to use about a cup of water and we're going to time that too. Okay, we got it all set up now. All we have to do is add our water in. We're doing exactly one cup. I got a uh, thermometer and a timer and a probe hooked up to this. So we're going to do set this timer up here. On. Okay, this we're outside, so this thing's reading. Um, this thing's is reading eight degrees Celsius. Uh, we've been sitting out here for quite a bit, so yeah. I was trying to. I just got this timer, so I was trying to figure out how that it works. So we're gonna set it uh, for ten minutes. Um, I haven't turned it on yet, but uh, we'll tr turn it on now. You can see the temperatures. Round six, let's set it up here. Okay, so it's going now. So we're gonna light this bad boy here. See how long it goes from 10 minutes.
Okay, we're about uh, a couple minutes into it and we're already up to about 53 Celsius. Okay, we're pretty much already at a rolling boil. Um, with like between three and four minutes. I'm pretty impressed. Yeah, I just did, uh, I just emptied the uh, pot out and I like that it left no burning residue or anything like that. Um, upcoming, I'm gonna be doing some other videos on some uh, alcohol stoves and we're gonna see how those work. As well as, I, I got a, also another kind of stove like this, but like a cheaper one, cheaper version. We're gonna look at that too uh, in the next coming weeks. For now, we're going to go over to Amazon and look at some of the details on this. All right, guys, we're over here on uh, Amazon.ca. As you can see, this is the product that I bought, the Coleman Classic One Burger Backpacking Stove. Um, you can see that it's temporarily out of stock right now. Um, actually, when I ordered it, it only said that there was one left. And right after I looked, it was temporarily out of stock. Uh, one question I'd like to, to find out is what's the difference between this stove and the Peak One stove uh, that you see right here? Now, the price is pretty much different. I paid $22.62 and this Peak One stove is $38.26 and everything looks pretty much the same, like the BPUs, etc. And even the picture, I mean, when you look at it, it's there's not much difference except for the color. The base of this may be a little bit thicker, I don't know, but they pretty much look the same. And now if you go to Amazon.com in the States, uh, they have this, um, which is the one I bought. Um, what they're saying, that's temporarily out of stock too. This was actually in stock yesterday when I checked. And then you go here and it looks like that, that peak one that we saw where over here like I mean it pretty much looks like the same thing uh, 2297 so I don't know what the difference is all I know is um, I really like the one I got right here and of course it's got all the information pictures and whatnot uh, so roll down here we go to uh, the about this item and all the related products I'm going to leave a link to this uh, product that I have, as well as the um, the timer that I got. Now, the timer that I got in this video and with the uh, probe and everything isn't the one I'm going to leave because uh, the actual original one that I got, I lost it. So I used the one in this video for uh, a replacement, but I really did like the one I had before. So I'm going to leave a link to that in the description below as well as any other links I, I have in this video, uh, stuff that I've used. Okay, guys, uh, that's pretty much it. Um, if you like this video, please like, subscribe, share, and uh, comment below. I really like to hear you, uh, your comments. And don't forget to hit that notification bell on the way out too, because you'll keep updated on the upcoming videos that I have. And I got uh, quite a few coming up, so stay tuned and we'll see you next time. Bye.